guys today we are going to learn how to solve a rubik cube as you can see on my table there are many types of rubik cubes today i'm going to teach you how to solve 3 by 3 rubik cube let's get started to shuffle the cube there are many ways to solve a cube i'm going to teach you one way for beginners we will solve, solve layer by layer. Solving each layer has several steps. Let's go into details in each step. Let's begin with the white layer. First step is to make a white cross on the yellow side as shown in the image. Opposite of white is yellow. So flip the cube. Um, and make the white cross the yellow side. Place the white middle pieces here. When you place the white middle pieces, make sure you don't remove any white piece which is already placed. We are finished with step 1. Second step is to move the white cross from the yellow side to the white side as shown in the image. Condition here is to match the connected white piece with the center piece. Rotate the top until it matches. Once it matches, Rotate the matching side two times. Repeat this for all the remaining white pieces. I fix the white cross. Ignore the, that white corner piece. I'll just get rid of it. We are in the last step in solving the white layer. Here we will fix the corner pieces. We will fix these corners. Let's pick the this red and blue corner piece and place it in the bottom layer between red and blue. Move the corner piece away, turn left to fix. The corner piece turn the left back. You can see the corner piece is fixed. Let's pick this blue and orange corner piece and place it in the bottom layer between orange and blue. Move the corner piece away. Turn left to fix the corner piece. Turn the left back. You can see the corner piece is fixed. Let's pick this corner. This should be in bottom layer. We have found another corner piece in the bottom layer. Let's pick this one now. Move, move the corner piece away. Turn left to fix the corner piece. Turn the left back. You can see the corner piece is fixed. Let's fix the last corner. Move the corner piece away. Turn left to fix the corner. Turn the left back. But the orientation is wrong. Let's bring it back to the bottom layer with the white facing on the side like all the other corners we fixed earlier. Move, move the corner piece away. Turn left to fix the corner piece. Turn the left back. You can see the corner piece is fixed. You can see we have fixed the white layer. Let's solve all the four middle pieces. With that, the middle layer will be solved.
Take a middle piece without yellow from the bottom layer. Let's take the blue orange piece and match it with blue center piece. Orange is on the right, so rotate bottom counterclockwise, right counterclockwise, bottom clockwise, and right clockwise. Now fix the corner piece. The middle, bl middle blue orange piece is fixed. Let's find another middle piece without yellow. Here is a green and red piece. Let's rotate the bottom side until green matches the center piece. Red side is on the right, so rotate bottom counterclockwise, right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, and right clockwise. Let's fix the corner with that. The green red middle piece is fixed. Blue is already matching the center and red is on the left. So rotate bottom left, bottom counterclockwise, left counterclockwise, fix the corner piece now, red, red and blue piece is fixed. Let's fix the last middle piece. Let's find the orange and green middle piece. Let's match green with green center. Orange is on the left, so rotate bottom clockwise, left clockwise, bottom counterclockwise, left counterclockwise. Fix the corner piece. All the middle pieces are fixed. Let's solve the last layer. Solving third layer has four simple steps. Each step has a fixed set of rotations to be performed. Make sure you hold the cube in the right direction. Let's start with the first step. There are three possibilities, a single yellow piece in the center, a hook or inverted L or a three straight yellow pieces. You can see them in the images below. All of this step is to have a yellow cross. If you already have a yellow cross, you can skip this step and go to the next step. To solve the third layer, let's flip the cube and keep yellow on top. I have a hook. Keep the hook on back left and follow these rotations. Front clockwise, right clockwise, top clockwise, right counter clockwise, top counter clockwise, front counter clockwise. Now I have a straight line. Keep the line horizontal and follow the same rotations again. Front clockwise, right clockwise, top clockwise, right counter clockwise, top counter clockwise, front counter clockwise. We are done with the first step. In this step, the yellow cross connected pieces have to match the center. There are there can be three possibilities: either all of the connected pieces are wrong, or two pieces are wrong or all the connected pieces are correct. If all the middle connected pieces match the center, this, then skip the, this step and go to the next step. In my case, two pieces are wrong. Keep the correct pieces back and right and follow these rotations. Right clockwise, stop clockwise, right counterclockwise, stop clockwise, right clockwise, top two times, right counterclockwise. If needed, rotate top layer once to match the centerpiece. We are, we are done with second step. In this step, we will move the corner pieces to its correct location. Do not worry about the orientation now. During this step, one, one or more pieces can be in wrong, wrong location. If all the pieces are correctly located, then we can skip this step and go to the last step. In my case, 
I have one piece in correct location. So keep the correct piece in top right position and follow these rotations. Top clockwise, right clockwise, top counterclockwise, left counterclockwise, top clockwise, right counterclockwise, top counterclockwise, left clockwise. You can see all the corner pieces are correct in location. Sometimes you may need to uh, repeat these rotations. We are in the final step of solving the Rubik cube. In the step, we will solve the orientation of the corner piece. There can be one or all pieces can be wrong. Keep the incorrect corner piece in top right and follow this rotation. Right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise, right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise. Rotate top side and bring the incorrect piece to top right and repeat the same rotation. Right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise, right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise. Rotate top side and bring the incorrect piece to top right and repeat the same rotation. Right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise, right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise. Repeat the same rotation. Right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, Right clockwise, bottom clockwise, right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise. Rotate top side and bring the incorrect piece to top right and repeat the same rotation. Right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise. Right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise. Repeat the same rotation. Right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise, right counterclockwise, bottom counterclockwise, right clockwise, bottom clockwise. We have solved the cube. Please try it yourself and let me know how it goes with you in comments below. If you find this video useful, please like and subscribe and share it with your friends. See you next time in different video. Bye bye.